For Sophie Howenham, dance has been a lifelong pursuit. She is partially paralysed below the waist, but that hasn't stopped her from chasing her dream. Dancing to me is something that comes from deep within. It's a passion that I live with and a language which I speak, for which I need no words. Sophie completed her studies in dance in the eastern German city of Dresden at the age of 19 and has been working as a freelance dancer on stages throughout Germany ever since. She began studying dance seriously at the age of 12. Some five years later, an abscess was found on her spine. She underwent emergency surgery to have it removed, but it was too late. It had already caused nerve damage to her spine and left her partially paralyzed. Two weeks after the onset of my paralysis, I recorded an improvised dance video and I realised that nothing had really changed. Perhaps my body had changed, but you can't take dance out of my heart and soul. She recorded this dance video in part to complete her studies, but she also realised something in the process. At the moment when I was diagnosed, I had this very blatant avoidance behaviour. For me and the life I have chosen, it's out of the question that I would never walk again, let alone dance again. I wanted to have control over my life, over my body and over deciding what I was going to do with my life. Her determination is apparent in her life both on and off the stage. When she's not dancing, she enjoys spending time in nature near her home in Dresden. She relies on her mental strength and other physical abilities to carry her through and refuses to be defined by her handicap. Handicaps are characteristics, like when you're small and you can't reach the cups on the shelf, or when a person has sensitive skin and needs sun protection factor 50 and not 30. That's how it was with me. I just had to learn to live with these new obstacles. Now at age 23, Sophie guest stars in various productions in Germany. She works with choreographers who create pieces around her disability. She says she wants to convey the free nature of dance, regardless of physical limitations. My dream has definitely come true. I have the life of a dancer. I get to come here, I get to see a lot of cities. I get to meet great people again. I'm living the life exactly as I'd wished, just completely different than I had imagined, which doesn't make it worse. Support props are often included in the works she performs in, like here in rehearsal for a new piece called Balance. For Sophie Howenham, dance has given her the focus and discipline needed for a successful second chance in life.